Hi there, welcome back to my channel. My name is Sandy Esprit and today I'm very excited to share with you a review from the L'Oreal Hair Expertise, ooh, let me try to get all this. The L'Oreal Hair Expertise Glycolic Gloss Line. Thank you very much to L'Oreal for sending these over. I had a great time trying them. So before I continue, before I continue, please take a minute to subscribe, give it a big thumbs up, Leave a comment down below if you've tried it. If you want to offer your thoughts, let's keep this conversation going. So I tried the shampoo, the conditioner, the five minute lamination, as well as the leave-in serums. So you're going to see how I used it. You're going to see the texture of the products, how I feel about it, what it did for my hair, the packaging, all of that good stuff. So let's just go ahead and get into it. So let's go ahead and start with the price point. Now, all of the products range from $10 to $15, depending on where you buy it. Um, you can get it on Amazon. You can get it at any drugstore. So I love the convenience of it, as well as it is budget-friendly. As you can see, the vibe of this line is pink chrome. It's very feminine, very glossy, very, you know, it's, it's giving pink chrome, pink gloss pink, you know, just very much like my makeup. I love it. I love it. I feel like we're on trend here. Let's talk about the packaging before we move on into the actual products themselves. So with the shampoo, the packaging, you have the pump at the top here, and then you will go ahead and turn it upside down to dispense it. This comes out very easily, which is really great. With the conditioner, the lid is at the bottom. You would open that up and squeeze out. Same with the lamination. You have the top flip up, the lid flips up. And for the gloss, the pump here. I love that the pump, yeah, so if you turn it to the left, it locks. If you turn it to the right, it will dispense. So this is really good when we're thinking about traveling. They are very travel friendly tops. I really like that. They are all also made of plastic and they are recyclable, which we love because it is convenient for us to travel with and it is eco-friendly. So now let's talk about the star ingredient of this line, which is glycolic acid. Now typically you probably think glycolic acid is found in skincare. You are correct. It is actually one of my favorite ingredients in my skincare routine. So imagine my surprise when I saw it within my hair care, within this particular hair care brand. Like what does glycolic acid have to offer me natural hair girly? In this particular case, glycolic acid helps to smooth and repair the hair cuticle, which I desperately need, <laughs> which we all do, especially with the given season, it is getting colder and our hair tends to be prone more to damage. So we want something that is going to smooth and repair hair cuticles, strengthen our hair. The whole line promises to boost shine, to reduce frizz and to leave your hair feeling softer. So does it live up? to its promises, let's see. So let's talk about the shampoo for a minute. Now you're gonna notice that when I washed my hair with this shampoo, I did double cleanse. The, of course, this is bottle here, it comes in a 200 ml bottle. I flipped it upside down to dispense the product. It is a very runny and lathers very quickly. You don't need a whole lot of shampoo for this one. It is very much cleansing. So if you're looking for something that's going to leave your hair slightly conditioned or slightly moisturized, this is not the one you're looking for. This here is there to cleanse. And if you have hair that is already over stripped and over dried, you're gonna want something a little more gentler than this one. It does come with a 2% gloss complex with glycolic acid. And so I double cleansed with it, scrubbed my scalp with it. I believe I even, I even used a scalp scrubber. I thought that it left my scalp feeling very nice, very clean. I'm not gonna lie, like for the scalp, this was it. I do find that it was a bit harsh on my curls itself. Probably you'd wanna follow up with a moisturizing cleanser or a cleanser that is very much gentle, like just to give your hair some of that oomph back. This shampoo has a light gel-like texture. I did find it to be very runny and I did find it to be very cleansing. 
this is something that would reach for if I'm looking for a hair reset that boosts shine. Not necessarily something that I would use if I'm not using much products during the week. So definitely, this is something just to look out for. That, that's my thoughts on it. Now for someone else, this could very much be the perfect shampoo, the perfect balance between moisturizing, hydrating, and cleansing. I would say this is more on the cleansing aspect than the moisturizing aspect. So I use it in my routine by putting it in my hair. I put it on my hands and I rub my hands together and I apply it straight focusing on the scalp because shampoo is meant to cleanse the scalp first and on the scalp I'm very rough. I am trying to get rid of it especially this week my scalp was really itchy and so I really wanted that glycolic complex to just get into my scalp. Please just repair it, get in there and because it's, it's a skin, I figure if it's good for skincare in the shampoo it should be good for my scalp as well, right? So I go in there and I'm scrubbing, scrubbing, scrubbing and I do that twice. I lather, I scrub it in the scalp, I rinse it out and then I follow up by the next time by focusing on the hair itself. Now because of, again, it's very lathering and cleansing aspect, I'm very, very gentle when I cleanse on my, my, on my curls the second time around. I'm making sure to part the hair and to gently detangle my hair, not in a way that is rough because I'm understanding that look, this, this one is pretty, it's, it's cleansing. It's, it's, it's not as moisturizing. There's not going to be as much slip. So I'm taking my time to really go through the hair and I'm using my hair to softly massage and gently make sure that the shampoo reaches the strands because I want the hair to be cleansed. I want that product buildup gone. And I really want to make sure that my hair is ready for the next step. But I want to do it without over stripping it, without over drying it, without leaving my hair too brittle to actually deal with the conditioner. So I did that twice and you can see that I'm really taking my time once I am satisfied with the way that my hair has been cleansed to making sure that the scalp and the hair get the appropriate cleansing action that it needs. I'm, I go ahead and I rinse out my hair with the shower head there. I absolutely love a handheld shower head. If you don't have a handheld one, please get yourself one. It's, it's just a lifesaver. <laughs> so next is the conditioner and this one has an 11% glycolic gloss. So definitely a higher concentration than 2%. This conditioner definitely has a hundred. Um, so this one definitely has more. And it comes with the lid at the bottom, as previously stated. Comes in a 150 mil tube. Again, smaller size than 200 mil, which makes sense because you're gonna use this twice, but this one you should only need to use once. It is creamy. I find that it has a very nice creamy consistency, a very nice creamy texture. I found it to be extremely good when it comes to the slip. I this shocked me especially considering how um, how cleansing this is this one comes with amazing slip I was able to detangle in the shower with this I thought it was great so yeah a very nice good slip very creamy I also felt like it had a bit of grit or there was something I'm not sure there's a little tiny grit gritty glossy thing in there I find that it was very moisturizing high uh, like very moisturizing very conditioning this conditioner absolutely comes through and does what it's supposed to I applied it in my hands rubbed it into my hands warm it up with my hands first and then I apply it to my hair starting with the ends and I work my way up I don't part my hair when I use conditioner but I, I really thought, I was impressed. I was impressed with this conditioner. It is really good. It's very hydrating. It definitely superseded my expectations and what I thought a conditioner should do. I apply this to my hands, apply it straight to my ends, and I work it through my hair. And while it's in my hair, I leave it in for a few minutes and I use my detangling brush to brush out all the knots which is easy to do when you have a buttery, soft, creamy conditioner that takes care of the slip. Honestly, this is such a good conditioner and definitely worth checking out if you're the type to, that 
detangles in the shower, which I actually highly recommend. You should detangle in shower to make sure that the conditioner gets through all of your hair strands. You don't want to leave one behind. You want to make sure that every single hair strand gets this. So I highly recommend once again, I highly recommend this conditioner. It is it is so good. Once I finish detangling it in my hair, I go and I leave it in for a few minutes and then I rinse it out. And of course, now, glossy hair, I think glossy hair doesn't take place without a lamination. And this five minute lamination, rinse, rinse out, what is it called? Yeah, rinse off the start of the show. It is really, really good. For five minutes, you get glossy hair. I mean, I don't know any other products that promises that. They probably do. I just, I just haven't heard of it. This one here with the lid here. Ooh, they have the lid at the top here, and this is the L'Oreal. This is L'Oreal's first at home glossy lamination treatment. Okay, and they did good. They delivered. They really did. It comes with a 200 ml bottle. So this lamination treatment is meant to act like an in-shower glossing treatment to seal the cuticle and to add that reflecting, that reflective shine to, I can't get the words out. And it's almost like a lotion that spreads evenly throughout the hair, which I love because ain't nobody trying to struggle. Nobody wants to struggle when putting on products, especially when you're doing it yourself, right? Because you can't see really see the back of your hair. But you want to be able to just reach in and make sure that no hair gets left behind. No strand left behind and this makes it easy. So when I applied this, I started in my ends and I applied it from the root. Applied it like I would a conditioner. So I start in the ends and I work my way up the hair shaft all the way up to the, to the top of course or to the mid shaft. However you are comfortable. And I left it in for five minutes, took the rest of my shower, and when I rinsed it out, my hair felt softer. It definitely looked shinier, and it's great. If you have hair that typically looks dull, and you're just like, I don't know how to add shine, this this is it for me. I really thought that this was a really great product. It was very easy to use. Applied it to my hair. It was also very easy to rinse out, and so it, it was just easy. I love easy, okay? Good results that are easy are my jam. So this, the glycolic gloss, I used it on my hair post shower when I was straightening out my hair when I gave myself a blowout. And this is a very glossy, the texture is very gel-like, very lightweight and just there's tiny shiny particles in there that I love. It has 14% glycolic gloss complex. And this one here, the lamination rinse off has 17% glycolic gloss complex. And this is not heavy at all. I thought it was very lightweight, easy to apply in the hair. And I sectioned my hair when I applied it, made sure that it went all around my hair. It, it's one of the serum -y, feels like a gel, oil type jelly. And yeah, that I used on my hair on my ends before drying it. So overall, I was really impressed with the line. I mean, I, I wasn't in love with everything, of course, but I was very much impressed with the line. I love the way that my hair felt afterwards. It was, it felt softer. It definitely felt softer. I noticed my hair was shinier and it just really felt healthier, which I love. And I think that the price point is amazing. I love that you can get this at a drugstore. You can get this at Amazon. And if you're looking for places to buy them, links are gonna be down below in the caption section below. And because they are affiliate links, I get a small commission, but don't worry, I'm gonna hook you up with the best price, all right? And so, yeah, I really, really loved it. I think it's worth trying out. And if you're looking for something to boost the shine in your hair, this is it. This is it. Right now we're in silk press season. Then you're looking for a shampoo to really give you that shine and give you that shiny hair. This this one is it. I really, I stand by it. That's the one. <laughs> I hope you enjoyed this review. If you did, please give this video a big thumbs up. Click that notification bell so that you don't miss another video. And don't forget to subscribe. Thank you very much for watching. And that's it from me. I will see you next time. Ciao for now.